Hello everyone, my name is Paula Novotna and I'm a professional kitesurfer. Today you can work out with me. I'm gonna show you my typical workout that I would do uh, if, when I don't have gym and I'm on the beach and I'm getting ready for kitesurfing, for example if there is no wind. So this is a full body workout that's gonna focus on actually every part of your body and get you ready for your kiteboarding sessions. We're gonna work with for we're gonna work our legs, our upper body, and also focus on our core to have strong core because strong core is a key for kiteboarders not to get injured and to, to lower their lower back pain. So I am really happy that I can show you my workout that I would normally do on a normal day. First, we're gonna start to with activation of our core, of our glutes and of mobilizing, mobilizing the shoulders to get ready for the workout. So, we lay on our back, back and tilt our pelvis and back and like this, up. And then you're gonna try to breathe in and breathe out. Try to put your breathe in from here and then hold it here. It, it should be like a big balloon on the sides. And hold it. And breathe out. And still hold it. Breathe in. And then breathe out. And still hold it. Now we can start to put one leg up, one leg down. One leg up, one leg down. And still holding the core. Now we can relax. And again, start to breathe in. Engage the core, make a little bubble, make, make a big balloon on the side and hold. Now we can try to put up both our legs up and uh, both our arms and go up. Down with opposite leg and arm and to the other side. And try to make your spine long as long as you can.
सा है So first of all, we're gonna focus on warming up our body and get the blood running to make sure to, to get ready for the real workout. So we're gonna start up with 30, with 20 squats. jumping lounges. Now 
make sure this is on the ground. So this was warm up. If you guys feel like you want to do one more warm up, go for it. And now we're gonna go for the real workout. So this was your warm up. If you feel like doing one or two rounds more, go for it. I did two. And now we're gonna focus on our real workout. What is gonna get you strong for kiteboarding. Strong legs, strong core, and strong shoulders and back. Let's do this. Okay, so now we have the heaviest kite bag, 15 kilo. And we can, or 10, unless you want to do less. A think of your, your kneecap cannot go over your toes. And we're gonna do 15, uh, 15 lunges on each side. gonna work your glutes and also your hamstrings. Long time ago when I kissed your lips 
bag. Then we're gonna go from side lounge to side lounge. And low. Any more seconds? Ten more. All right, now we're gonna rest for thirty seconds. Okay, in ten seconds we do side to side plank. Take some water.
Light me up, don't you stop Cause tonight, it's on the line Show me how, you get on down Close my eyes, take me for a ride Go on the thing on another side. Then hops. So come and light me up. I still need your fire, baby. I still want you by my side. Light me up. Let me touch the flame now, baby. I'm your Phoenix tonight. Come on and ride. Ten more seconds. Alright, now we're gonna focus on moving push-ups, then moving push-ups. We will rise to the skies, cause we ain't done till we hit the sun. Take the smaller sky back. Take the smaller sky back. I fill it up with can. And we do first side to side. If you feel like 90, do 90. If you feel like 30, do 30. But set a goal and do it.
workout with Paula is done. I hope you guys like it. And let's see, maybe I make more of my workouts. This is a workout again, what I would do on a day when I could not kite and could not go to the gym and still work full body and get ready for the action on the water. So have fun and thanks for working out with me. Hope to see you guys again. Stay tuned.